we started off like we were like we're teenagers, so we have interest in beauty and what is like pretty, and so we started off with like is there actually a scientific formula for being pretty or not? And then we found the correlation with the Domus Index, and then we just started to research and like we found we found out that like that that there is a formula for, for like being pretty, but that's not the only thing that makes you attractive to the other gender like. There's also the NHC, which is the major histocompatibility complex, and that's basically about scent, like how you smell. So we found out that like the whole the whole approach is like how attraction comes together. Like if, if there's only one point that makes you like pretty, if it's just the face or the nose or whatever, like it is all it's like all big coming together. Uh, we actually like, search about Barbie because Barbie usually we say that she has the perfect body and all that stuff, and how this ecological impact has Barbie and our society. And she's actually, she couldn't exist, you know? Yeah, but actually, cause she could only have half a liver because, like, her body proportions are, like, totally yeah. wrong. And, like, Bar Barbie has a huge impact on children because, like, children want to have long, like, teenagers want to have long legs and, like, Barbie has long legs. And she could, if she would want, like, she has foot, like, her foot set would have size three. And with her height, she couldn't walk, like, she had to walk on the whole, of course, like, and that's what we found out, that she has a huge impact yeah. on children, like, because, like, she's so wrong, and but children want to be like her. And, I mean, children are influ influenced by, like, ce uh, celebrities, and yeah. if they see, like, a, a pretty celebrity, they want to be like, they want to look like her. And we found out that, like, uh, Selena, Gomez. Selena Gomez is, like, uh, she was a Disney star, so every child watches Disney. Yeah. Disney's channel.